ladies and gentlemen, let's keep the comedy train chugging down the tracks. I think we're off the tracks. I think we're off. I think we're. I think we're. I think we're crashing into streetcars at this point. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage the runner-up of the 2019 finalist contest. Finalist, John Ripley. Hey! Hey! Welcome everybody! Good stuff. Uh, everybody have a good day today? Uh, yeah! Me too! I'm pretty pumped. Uh, my, um, my in-laws are coming to town for their 4th of July. July? July? Let me say that again, because I can't talk. Um, my, my in-laws are coming for the 4th of July, so it's gonna be cool. So I've been doing a lot of fucking yard work. Like, I'm doing all the like super kind of basic middle-class yard things. Like, we got one of those adult blue inflatable pools, and I built a fucking fire pit today, and I mowed the lawn. And I mowed the lawn first, but I did something new. I mowed the lawn wearing my fucking sunglasses and not my actual glasses. <laughs> which is funny. Oh! Oh! <laughs> you want your seat back? <laughs> These are my backup pair because I stepped on my fucking glasses today when I was inflating the giant adult pool. But anyways, that's, what were they talking about? Oh, mowing that lawn. <laughs> I, I, I wore sunglasses, which is so good in the sun, you know what I mean? It's like, the sun's not nearly as fucking bright, and everything's got a cooler, like, tint to it. Like, life is disappointing when you take your sunglasses off. But, so I'm mowing the lawn, which is great, because my eyes are protected from the sun, but my vision sucks now because I don't have prescription sunglasses, so I can't fucking see like what I'm doing. So I take my glass, you know, I, I mow a lot, like I mowed a couple rows. I guess I should, you do that, right? Mow rows. <laughs> it sounds like a name of an old like fucking Vegas guy. Oh, mow rows. Anyways, <laughs> I, I, fucking. I mow a couple rows and I'm like, fuck, am I even doing this straight? I can't tell anything. I take the sunglasses off, but I can't see anything because I don't have my fucking glasses on. Jeez, right? <laughs> so I was backing out my driveway to come here and I noticed I ran one of my kids over the fucking lawnmower. <laughs> my wife's here and she can barely hold together because I, you know, <laughs> oh, this is fucking great. Guys, but really why I'm here is um, I'm an artist. I'm not actually a comic, obviously. I'm an artist. So a couple of my pieces here are for sale. My skateboards. The middle one's not for sale. I wrote the middle one here. That's why it has reels on it. And my big piece is right above you. <laughs> It's called a long silver turd. <laughs> That'd be a fun thing to climb through, like Mission Impossible. Like, cool. Um, I've had hundreds of jobs. I've been an artist. Um, I've sold meat door to door. I've been a park ranger. I've been a school bus driver. I've been a waiter at 198 restaurants. And I, I finally realized that I don't have, like, my, my, my career outlook is terrible. And really, when, when my sister-in-law, a couple weeks ago I was visiting my brother, my sister-in-law was like, John, you know what you'd be really fucking great at? You know what I think would be like your fucking calling? Being a guidance counselor. <laughs> She's like, seriously, you would be so good at it. And at first I was like, God damn it. Then I was like, you know what? I would be a fucking good guidance counselor. 
I've had so many shitty jobs. I had hundreds. I could steer all these kids into the right shitty job for them. <laughs> like the, the jocks, I could be like, steer them into sales. And the creative kids could do marketing. customer service and marketing, yeah. <laughs> and the fucking nerds will take care of themselves. <laughs> All right, that's my time. If you know this, because this is a secret, but every comic on the show tonight was told not to wear shorts. <laughs> John, who made the silver shit above your heads, is the rebel. <laughs>